Hello everybody, this is PixCat57 here, and I have a big haul. Well, it's the biggest, but yeah. I've got tons of different Beanie Boos, Beanie Babies, and some Thomas and Friends as well. So, we're gonna look at the smallest and we'll go up to the biggest. Starting off with this little guy right here. This right here is a Thomas. Not just any ordinary Thomas. It is a take along Thomas that you can actually power up pretty much. It's, you know, one of those little motorized things. It runs behind its cart. It's gonna get it running for you. Bye bye, Thomas. And now for the next thing. It's this guy. This guy was a little beanie boo I found at um uh, at Value Village. This guy is Letter, and he's from 2013. I don't really know what line he's from because he doesn't really look like a beanie boo, as if you may know. Beanie boos look not like this. But, you know, I thought this was a beanie baby or a beanie boo. But yeah, it has the solid eyes, not the sparklies. So, I think this is a good idea to get for the collection. Moving on. The next thing I got is these two guys right here. This is Leona and Slush. Two Beanie Boos, which, um, haven't, which I've been looking for one of them, which is Leona right here. And this one is missing a tooth tag. I have bigger and smaller versions of this beanie, so I know the name and everything, and the poem and whatever. Next up is Slush, and I actually own a regular Slush, but the regular one I have is, well, it kind of sucks. It is, it is worn down, it, it, it's, it's pellets keep on falling out because there's a piece of, there's a piece of it just missing. Yeah. But the tag is still on that one, so, well, I'm just gonna, this one for like skits and filming and whatever. You're just gonna be like, you know, something. I'm gonna be making some Beanie Boo skits. So yeah, anyways, moving on. So this beanie that I'm like to show right here is Muffin, a really nice Beanie Boo, a nice, really nice Beanie Boo that I got at Valley Village. Now, this one is very, very cool because I've actually been looking for this beanie and for so long. Now just, I'm, I'm trying to peel off there. Now this one I've been looking for for so long. It's one of my favorite beanies. I really like to get a regular sized version. It is not the, this, the right size for, well, for me. And there's a weird sticker on this too. Yeah, I'm gonna need to remove this as well. There we go. And it is from, this Beanie Boo is from 2014. 2014, the year this Beanie Boo was discontinued. So yeah, I really wish I can get like the regular version, but at least I got a new, uh, at least I got one version of this Beanie Boo. Anyways, next Beanie Boos. Okay, so the next things I have are two large Beanie Boos, which are from the older era. And I've been looking for older era Beanie Boos for so long, and I'm glad that I've at least found some larger ones. So let's start with this guy right here. This is Waddles, one of the first Beanie Boos. Now he is labeled 2012, if you need to see you. He is from 2012. He is in okay condition, missing a tag since most of the older beanies are missing tags. And this one is this one is Julep. This one is from 2011. I saw it on the tag, on the tush tag at least, and it has no main tag. Quite, quite some nice beanies. Now, moving on to the biggest thing I got. Now, for the big one. I got a large tub of Thomas and Friends New Trackmaster. Now you might be wondering, why New Trackmaster? 
when there was old Trackmaster at Value Village and you could have got it. First of all, those old Trackmaster ones were in a bin with random other stuff that I didn't need. So I just didn't get them. And they were all stuff I knew I already had. So, but I got this for two reasons. First of all, first of all, well, to upgrade my tracks. And I definitely need more straight pieces, even though I have two tubs of straight pieces. And second of all, this guy right here. This guy, I do not have a working Toby. Well, I do, but you know, the one I have is having a wonky wheel right now. So what it means is one of the wheels, like let's just say this one, just doesn't move. And it's so hard to con. I need to spare enough batteries in them. I did not add those batteries, it came. So yeah, I'm so happy to have a new Toby that can actually, that works pretty good now. And I also have some extra packs of this. And the, the green bridge, right, right here. And it's, right here, there's two Thomases in this. Because a haul wouldn't be complete if you get two Thomases in a large box. Oh, so there's some Thomas stuff. And there's a Percy as well. Which may be one of my go-to Percy's because it looks in phenomenal condition. All of these are in great condition. Like, Literally, the only thing that isn't in great condition is a Thomas that's in there. It's missing eyebrows. But you know, it's no problem because there's another Thomas in there and it's in great condition. This was a great find. So, what did you guys think of my haul? Write down in the comments what you think. And should I do more thrift store videos? Because I think I should. You tell me in the comments if you want more of these videos. Make sure to like and subscribe and watch my other videos because not a lot of people have actually watched my other videos. You should definitely check them out. And if you like this video, then you'll definitely like my other videos. Some of the videos are probably linked in the description. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys!